What is up, you guys? I'm Charming. So today, I'm gonna be reacting to some more Reddit. And today, we'll be looking at some more a hole design, which. I mean, I, do I need to explain it? It's basically things that are designed really badly or in um, an a hole ish way. So, uh, yeah, I think that's the best explanation I can give. But with that being said, I hope you guys like this. Without any further ado, let's begin. All right, the one thing I bought this candle for, it doesn't do. All right, so it's a candle by Off who make bug spray. And then they have at the bottom, not intended to repel mosquitoes. Then what is it? It's just a candle? Citronella scented candle. I thought that smell was supposed to get rid of mosquitoes. <laughs> Wait, so this, they're selling just a candle, that's all they're selling, and it doesn't have any benefits. That is a pretty big a-hole design right there. Fake pockets in women's clothing. Oh, so it's just made to look like it's... It's a pocket. That is very annoying. That would be so annoying. I've seen uh, clothes like that. It does. It's not even just for women's clothing. I've seen it in men's clothing. It's very annoying. All right, best promotion I've ever seen. Oh, that is. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's eight hot dogs plus an, a bonus two hot dogs. So you see, at the the first picture, it's got like a little present here with another two hot dogs in it. So you're like, oh, I'm getting I'm getting a bonus. But then you look, and they just took the two that would have been here and moved it over there. That is a a, a hole design. That is hilarious. Bonus hot dogs, everybody. Bonus hot dogs because it's good. Charge for a less security. Oh, so you're basically making an account somewhere. There's a paywall behind setting up your password. That is a. I, I wouldn't even use that site at that point. Like, what well, that's scummy. It's so scummy. This fake solar cell in my calculator. Now, I've seen calculators kind of like that. I don't know if they're fake or not, but I've always wondered what... It, does that actually do anything? These solar cells? Because sometimes I know they can do stuff. If you cover it up, it will, it'll actually affect it. But then, you know, you cover it up and it doesn't do anything. So I wouldn't be surprised if some of the ones I've used have been like this. All right, YouTube can now send you push notifications of recommended videos. And if you disable it, it also gets rid of your subscription push notifications. Really? What are, what are you doing, YouTube? So you have to have pop-ups of recommended stuff that you're not even subscribed to, but if, if you try to get rid of it, then you don't even get the stuff that you're subscribed to. That is an a-hole design. I hope these people burn in hell. It's a little bit strong, but okay. Uh, so it's some kind of food. <laughs> and then inside of it, it's all the food is shoved to the outside, and there's just a little bit inside. That is an a-hole design. In other videos where I have reacted to this subreddit, I've seen other stuff similar to this. I don't understand how companies can get away with it. Like, if I were to buy a product and have this be the result, I would never, never buy from that company again. And I assume a lot of other people would either, so I don't know how that company could stay afloat. Like, you'd think they would go out of business. And, um, companies that do this kind of stuff, I kind of hope they do. This morning I noticed YouTube is showing videos in my sub feed from channels I'm not subscribed to. Why? 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 Why do they gotta mess with every single freaking feed? My subscriptions feed is like, a lot, I know a lot of people go to other feeds. I almost solely use my subscription feed because all I care about is the people I subscribe to. I don't want to see videos from other people. Maybe now and then I might go to trending or something like that, but normally I just stick to subscriptions. Jacksepticeye. <laughs> You're not even subscribed to Jacksepticeye. Oh, that's very annoying. An ad which has a fake close sign to redirect you to their app. Oh, I've, I've seen stuff like this. Look at this. You got two of them here. I'm pretty sure this is the fake one, right? And this is the real one that closes it? <laughs> it might be the other way around. I don't know. All right, here's an advertisement for an app, I guess. And it says, go premium. Premium users lose six times more weight on average. How does that work? All right, so I guess they give you, like, the tools you need to break habits and start healthy ones, nutrient dashboard, and food analysis. Premium users lose six times more weight on average. I don't know if I believe that. It might be true. But, I mean, the best way to lose weight is legit to count your calories. Don't go over, if you're a female, I think, you, I think you're supposed to be at like 1,500 calories a day. If you're male, like 2,000 calories a day, don't go over that and you'll start losing weight. And if you aren't, then you just cut it back a little bit until you are. And then you keep going until you're at your ideal weight, then you just bump it up a little bit. There you go. Not that hard. 
I just saved you freaking five dollars or whatever. All right, so this says you want three worsts. What is this like a a meat snack or something? I don't know. It's in a different language, but this says snack, so I assume it's a meat snack. Anyway, you want three? Well, screw you. Wait, there's only two in there, even though this has a picture of three. <laughs> oh my goodness. I would call that, that company and complain. Like, that's so... Ugh. This subreddit makes me mad. It it's actually makes me mad. I do not have a good time on this subreddit. It's just... It, like, sure, they're, it's funny, but at the same time, it just pisses me off. Because I could put myself into their, into their feet or whatever. And I'm like, oh, that would drive me nuts. Alright, um, here's an app. Meat Grinder. It's free for a six-day trial. After the free trial, it's $100 a week. $100 a week? What the frig is Meat Grinder? $100 a week for an app? Is that- is that- am I- is that real? It looks like a video game. $100 a- a week? I don't believe it. I don't believe it. Alright, here's a chocolate chip cookie, I guess. It's supposed to look like this, you know, with all the crazy colorful chocolates. <laughs> and then it's just- a normal chocolate chip cookie. There are no colors. This is so sad. Hey, at least it's got chocolate chips in it. <laughs> Could be worse. This app isn't telling me how much its premium membership is. Start. Three days free, then question mark, question mark, question mark per week. That's an a-hole move. You're not gonna tell them how much per week is pro- What is it? It couldn't be worse than $100 per week like the other one. <laughs> A hundred bucks a week. That's insane. I find it hard to believe it could be worse than that. All right, so here's a neighborhood. It looks like it's on Google Street View. Neighborhood where every driveway is half the length of a car and barely wide enough for one. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I don't believe it. First off, the neighborhood looks really nice. I won't lie, it looks really nice. But look at that. The cars are almost on the road. That's nuts. I mean, you have a garage, right? You can see the garage there. So you could probably fit like one car in there. But most people have more than one car, you know, most, you know, most families have two cars, at least. <laughs> oh, that'd be horrible to live there. I mean, it looks beautiful. If you don't have a car, it might be nice, but, but then again, if you're just gonna walk or ride your bike, you'd be riding around cars all the time. Anyway, that's it for this video. I hope you guys liked it. I, uh, I don't know how long this is going to be, because I, I've, I've got through so many of them, but I'm probably not gonna include a lot of them. A lot of them! I mean, like... 40% <laughs> or higher are just people complaining about YouTube, uh, you know, putting other people's videos that they're not subscribed to into their subscription feed. But anyway, I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you're new, hit subscribe to the family. I'll see you guys next time. Boop.